Merry Christmas and Happy New Year to all of you, my dear brothers, their eminences, the Archbishops and Metropolitans of our Holy Syriac Orthodox Church of Antioch, to our beloved spiritual children, the clergy, the deacons, and the entire Syriac Orthodox people throughout the world and all those who celebrate this holy season of the incarnation of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. From here, from Damascus, the oldest inhabited capital in the world, the city of our forefathers, we send you our greetings on this blessed occasion. We know it has not been an easy year for most of us. Many of us lost loved ones to this pandemic. In many parts of the world, wars did not cease, famine grew, and difficulties rose to many people. And it's in such situations we should remember the great event that happened over 2,000 years ago in the city of Bethlehem, when God abandoned his own glory and was born among us in a manger. He was born like a poor, the one who enriches the whole world. He was born to suffer on our behalf that we may gain victory, happiness, and salvation through his death and resurrection. Yes, it has been an awful year for the entire world, but this should not crush the faith that is in us and the hope in a better life. Jesus, our Lord, said, I have come to give you life, life in abundance, life that is different based on this hope and promise. We celebrate the birth of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel. God is with us. Yes, indeed, this event in Bethlehem showed us that God is not far away from us, but he is rather very near to us. He is in each one of us. Through him we live, through him we have our being, and with him we hope to live everlasting life of joy and happiness. My dear beloved, as you celebrate this holy event, remember that there are people who are suffering even more than you. There are people who are less, less fortunate than you, who may not be able to even celebrate this divine holy event. Keep them in your prayers. Pray for the entire world. Contribute to the peace of the world by doing your own share. Thus, we fulfill the angels' promise when they appeared in the skies of Bethlehem, giving glory to God in the highest, peace on earth, and goodwill and happiness to humanity. May God bless you all. You may have a very blessed and merry Christmas and a wonderful and happy, healthy, and blessed New Year.